we try to think that we want to have gas, cheap gas, and from the country we like to have it. And at the end of the day, the gas is where it is. Yeah, I mean, we've had this incredible situation where Mr. Trump uh, had a, a, a very strong words with Jens Stoltenberg about Frau Merkel, about the German energy policy, stroke defence policy as well. Where do you stand on looking at Nord Stream 2 coming in from the north and then LNG ports as well, which are going to be servicing US LNG as well? Are we going to need all product or actually can we, be, uh, can we pick and choose perhaps? Well, we're going to have both. We're going to have LNG. Uh, LNG is more for seasonal uh, reasons, so for, for peak uh, demand and we're going to have uh, natural gas coming from Russia, Azerbaijan and other countries and normally cheaper than the LNG. Yeah, because you have your own LNG terminals as well, well we but, have but, but, but it's expensive. 40% of the uh, capacity in Europe is, uh, is in the... 40% of the capacity in Europe. So, do you, so you clearly think that LNG prices are going yeah. to come down yeah. in comparison to yeah. other gas sources? Yeah. Well, in order to, 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 uh, to, to use uh, the, the capacity of our terminals, we need a physical energy union within the European Union. Yes. So we need more infrastructures in order to connect France with Spain and, uh, the example I was saying before, the, the pipeline connecting uh, Italy yeah. with Azerbaijan. So we need some pi more pipelines to be done in order to have a real physical uh, energy union. Why isn't that investment happening? Why is that project not happening? <sighs> That's a good question because, uh, because, I mean, nowadays we think that any investment around gas, it's not worth it because we think well, many politicians think that the gas, again, is a transition and it's not going to be there in 10, 10 so, years. So where is this misguided thought coming from? Is it the commission that's at fault? No, is it regional no. governments that it's are regional fault? governments. I really think it's regional governments. Uh, I mean, if, if you look at, at the grid, you see that you have a very strong grids within the com countries, but you, have, you don't have the same grid connecting both countries. So if Europe was to be a real energy union, as, as the countries are by themselves, you will have a different, you, you should, we should have a different grid. Commission is pushing very hard for those uh, projects to come true. So you have uh, the connection between Spain and France, Spain and Portugal, Croatia, uh, um, uh, TAP. So Commission is pushing. But hey everybody, it's Hadley Gamble from our new CNBC Middle East Bureau in Abu Dhabi. Thanks for stopping by. Now to watch more, you can try one of the videos that just popped up on your screen. And don't forget to subscribe.